Welcome to the Campfire Confessional. <laughs> We're here catching up with Michael Ray. Do you remember the first time we met? I do. It was my first time in Australia, actually. At the awards, and they go, hey, you're going to go sit over here. Morgan's going to interview you. <laughs> and our first time meeting was live on camera. And you've been on the road a lot since then, right? You're Crushing it. Non-stop, I feel. And when you're on the road all the time, obviously, we were talking about this off air, there's cracker barrels at every road stop. Do you have any favorite cracker barrel memories? My family loves Cracker Barrel, and so my favorite memories of Cracker Barrel was uh, after church every Sunday and just kind of having a little bit of time to sit and actually have a meal and be able to roll out. So you've got a new record coming out soon. You've named it after your late grandfather, which I think is an incredible tribute. Tell me how all that happened. My, when my grandfather got out of the Army, he's he taught my family how to play guitar. It's his passion of, of country music and music in general. Uh, that he passed down to my, my dad and my uncle and cousins and then passed down to us grandkids. And If I peel back my layers and my story, it all starts with my grandfather. And when it came time to name the album, it kind of just felt like it was a no-brainer for us. Yeah. It was, a, especially for me, it was, you know, I want to I wanna tell his story and I want, I want people to know that this is where I started. This is the reason I got into country music was because of Amos. Love it, man.